here we are, new video of Big Apple Pipes. As you can tell, I'm here to talk about something related to Christmas. This is one of the oddities of New York City. Uh, the It's always Christmas in New York shop. They sell 360 days a year uh, objects, products, toys, related decorations related to Christmas. And that's why I'm here to talk about the Kringle Flake from Sutley. As you may know, this is a limited edition tobacco and it's composed of only Red Virginia. It's a flake of Red Virginia, so it remembers, it reminds me, obviously, for every reference, it's pretty obvious to what McLellan was doing. Um, there is Compared to what McClellan was doing with the Christmas cheer, there is no indication whatsoever about this tobacco, uh, the year when it was harvested or any other information, but we only know that it's a uh, flake of Virginia. Now, uh, I'll show you how this looks like. And that's it. Now I will smoke this for the next week or so, and then we'll see how it is. I really like this label because, I mean, it's a little bit like a Christmas card in which you can put from who, from to, from so it's like a gift in this case i will put my name in both fields anyway let's just open it and just open it for the italian review and look the color is just unbelievable light brown orange it's unbelievable and the smell it's really this smell of figs prunes apricot it's unbelievable and it's it's really not very moist but look how greasy it is you just do like this and remain it's sticky to the fingers and you cannot see it but it is a little bit shiny it's super greasy oily it's 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 unbelievable i mean uh, i uh, let's see i'm very curious to try it but just by how it looks it's really quite something because it's greasy oily it really looks like something juicy wow anyway let's let's give it a go let's try i'll let you know how it looks. Here we are from the countryside of Italy. Um, I've been spending here uh, my Christmas holidays and I really enjoyed smoking the Kringle Flake. Uh, before starting, I just wanted to um, hop to say that I hope you, all of you had a wonderful uh, Christmas and also you had a beautiful uh, New Year's Eve. Um, I did, it was nice, I had a lot of food <laughs> and now I'm getting ready uh, to uh, fly back to, to New York. Um, the Kringle Flake, as I was saying, it has been, it has really been my holiday uh, tobacco. I always mock this uh, this tobacco um, and I actually pretty enjoyed it. Uh, I mean, I know you, you know, uh, before uh, Christmas, I've been smoking uh, only Balkans to do my Balkan throwdown review and probably this affected the way I felt about this tobacco at the beginning. I was a little bit confused, probably because I had to get used again to the Virginia, to the straight Virginia tobaccos. But actually, this has been a crescendo. It has been really, uh, every smoke was better than the previous one. So I have really enjoyed this tobacco. It is not as sweet as it is maybe the Carolina Red Flake or as it's written um, also on the internet. It smells very sweet but actually it goes to another direction. It's more uh, acidic, it's more uh, zesty, it's more, it's not, um, it's not spicy at all. It's very interesting though. I mean, it's, I really like it. And again, every smoke I am discovering something new and I'm really liking it. What a pity is that uh, Satellif didn't actually release any information about this tobacco. I mean, they just said it's a Christmas edition. It's Red Virginia pressed and cut into flakes and they didn't say anything else. So if, I mean, for the Carana Red Flake, we know so many things we know it has been uh, harvested in 2015 so it has been aged it's this kind of quality all those information which is interesting and it also allows you to, to think to to think about the aging process and so on we really know nothing we really know say nothing anything we don't we don't know much about this thing <laughs> except that it has been a limited edition we don't even know how many tins have been produced so that's a pity because I think it could add a little more character and uh, charm to this uh, tobacco, which at the end of the day, I really like it. So if you still find it available online on tobacco shops, I will definitely recommend if you like Red Virginia, I would definitely recommend this tobacco. I liked it a lot. It's not as sweet as the Carolina Red Flake, so don't expect that kind of uh, taste. It's similar to the Red Virginia Crumble Cake, always from Satleaf, but it 
it's, I think it goes to another level in terms of uh, depth, layers of taste. It's more complex. It's more interesting. Um, so it's, it remains in that um, darker kind of, of flavors, but to another level. So it's, it's, very, it's very interesting. It's very nice. And I definitely liked it. And I will keep on smoking it for a few days because, again, uh, I am enjoying it more and more as much as I do. So I wish you all um, uh, this, a great start of the year. And I'll see you from New York with a new video. Bye.